Working Together programme that we have here in the library today, it's really focused on children before they start, start school. So what we're, the message we're trying to get across to parents and to children themselves is that you're never too young to read and you're never too young to be a member of your local library. Today, it's what we're going to do is we're going to create. A, I've, I've kind of we've got a big vista with some suggestions of locations there, but there are no people. And what I'm going to do is get all our participants, all the kids that are coming in today. We're, they're going to be drawn and filling in the, the gaps in the background, and we're going to try and create almost our own Where's Larry scenario, where we have loads of different characters, loads of things going on and hopefully loads of little leprechauns hidden around the place. Well, the main thing is I'm hoping they're going to have a bit of fun. Um, we're going to kind of be moving around, having a bit of crack, but I, I think they're going to go away from this feeling like they've joined into something big and also that I have no doubt it's a brilliant thing working with with kids their confidence is fantastic and that is I take a lot out of that personally but I'm hoping they're going away from this it'll stimulate their imagination and they'll keep drawing and keep working the aim of the Reading Residence is to promote literacy and reading among young children. All the studies have shown that children who read are the most, I suppose, focused children and have the best results um, overall in terms of their um, academic ability, their empathy, their overall well-being and that's what we're trying to promote here in Wexford. So we appointed Caroline and um, the Reader in Residence um, for a period of nine months and during that time she would be focused on delivering a whole range of programmes to children in the county. I am an installation artist um, and I create um, generally large three-dimensional site-specific installations but I also work in print and I work in clay um, and I'm passionate about sharing those skills with young people and, and communities. The objective really is to get kids into a really interactive, fun play which involves the whole family with not necessarily a final product, it's the process of play and the process of them exploring themselves, exploring the materials. So we're talking about um, home or a sense of place um, and a room of their own. So we, over here we're going to start off with some clay and they're going to make some little bird nests, um, put some um, materials together. It's all about for that age group dexterity and ex exploring things. And then we have all these materials which are all recycled and the kids are going to put together something from their imagination inspired by a room of their own. So we've had an overwhelming response to the Reader and Residence programme. Um, from all age groups, from preschool, um, Carolyn has visited many preschools in the county and is looking at an early literacy programme so that children are introduced to books before they start school. And also then from school going children, Lots and lots of teachers have been in contact and um, she's visited lots of schools, looking at recommending reads and books and also creating that really important link between the school and their local library because that is a facility that we have there for um, schools that they will interact with their local library. It's, it's all about their engagement with the story and their um, their creative input and also their response from what from what they from what they're hearing because at that age obviously it's not really about about writing it's about responding naturally to 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 language so the whole aim is to get families in to get babies to get young children into the library and to i suppose introduce library usage into your their weekly and and daily routines so bedtime stories so important it's a really nice time of the day to sit down to relax with a picture book to read to your children to in, include them and um, to um, speak to them about their day and to read a book it really increases empathy and it really increases literacy